the great temple built by Maharaja Ranveer Singh between 19, 1870 to 1884. This is one of the temples out of 250 created by the Dogra during the Dogra Raj by the Dogra kings between 1846 and 1946. Exactly 100 years. I, also take, I will also take this opportunity to convey to you that you have a great, to all the people of JNK, especially the youth, that you have a great heritage. And people before us have created enough infrastructure in all the sectors, whether it is social, whether it is economic, and whether it is political, unfortunately, Today I find, and we all find, that there is a sense of despair. There is a sense of um, um, helplessness among the youth. And that is primarily because we don't have opportunities. Now, the opportunities are, have to be created by us by looking at as to what we have inherited from the past generations. And as an example I'll give you, an organization called Dharma Trust, which was created by Maharaja Gulab Singh in 1846, soon after he took over the reins of the state of Jammu and Kashmir. Today Dr. Karan Singh is the soldier. It is within the, because it is a private trust for a public purpose, for a religious public purpose, and it has promoted over the years, apart from building temples and the religion, it has promoted the art and culture. Scholars across the world come and visit this uh, library. Today we are in the process of digitization and uploading these rare manuscripts onto the internet so that it is available across the world. There was earlier a attitude of keeping them safe and secret. Today, we are opening up these uh, documents uh, of value uh, and knowledge to the rest of the world. As far as education is concerned, we have the Ladakh is known to be perhaps the first newspaper in English in India was published in Ladakh. And therefore, our Jammu has had a great tradition of, uh, the, uh, of education. And uh, in Punjab, our college, people from the rest of the Punjab used to come to our colleges in Jammu. And as far as uh, Kashmir is concerned, it is right from the ancient days, its educational uh, potential as well as its knowledge and uh, the institutions that were built 2,500 years ago are still, for example, the Sharda script and some of our Kashmiris are today across the globe leading some of the uh, multinational companies. So therefore, there is no reason for the youth Jammu and Kashmir, as well as the rest of the countries, we, that they should not progress beyond the, our own horizons, but into the rest of the world, and make their name. And I'm sure that uh, this period of turmoil for the last 25 years, has, which has taken the toll, is also now pittering out and better future is, we can see a better future for our people and for our children. That a world cultural event is being held in the month of March at Delhi. Where I am told that lakhs of people across the globe are participating. And this event is held in various countries and this year, it is being held at Delhi, supported by 
श्री श्री रविशंकर जी आई प्रे ऑन बिहाफ ऑफ द धर्मा ट्रस्ट दैट दिस ग्रैंड इवेंट इज सक्सेसफुल एंड आई ऑल्सो विश दम that they are able to use this event to really project the indian arts and culture to the rest of the world which is so rich as far as jammu and kashmir is concerned future of our state we have miles to go to reach even reach closer to what is in the rest of the country but i can assure you that it is going to be done in a very high speed i would thank sushil ji that in this great even a small window from the cultural heritage of jnk will also be presented for the benefit of everyone present there thank you very much